Okay, so you got yourself a brand new wool pad and uh, you notice all this excess wool that's left, that's on this pad and uh, when you start to buff, right, all the wool will fly around. So, um, don't worry, today I'm going to share you, with you a tip on how to remove this excess wool. Stay tuned. Right, so I got here a 4-ply 100% twisted wool pad, brand new and uh, there are a lot of loads of excess wool. So uh, what I've been taught, to use a spur, run the machine, spur it and the loose wool will come out, right? Uh, this can be done, uh, just that it's a bit too messy, right? So what you really need is, or what I would use, is just a bucket of water, alright? So uh, set the speed lower setting, uh, which is 1, around 600 RPMs. So just turn it on, alright? Wet your hands and put your hands over, alright? You will see the wool come out and... Uh, okay, water here acts as uh, two things. Number one, so that the wool will stick to your fingers, alright? Number two, uh, with water on the wool, it has weight, so it will fall down, it won't fly all over the place, alright? So this is what I use, this is what I do, alright? So you always want to keep your hands moist uh, and use water off and on, alright? This is just plain water, alright? So uh, keep doing this for about 5 to 10 minutes for every new wool pad and uh, once you use it, you can just, and then you will not, you will not get those wool flying around. Okay, so this is what I would do to remove loose excess wool on every new wool pad, right? And I only do it when it's new, when I just get it out from the box, right? So uh, if it's seasoned, it will not, it will not lint as much as, as, as when it's new, right? So um, if you have any other ways of doing so, please share with us on the comment box and uh, remember to subscribe to our channel for more tips coming your way.